A Hobbs family wants answers tonight after the man who police say murdered their son was allowed to leave jail. That suspect is a convicted felon and was found just months ago in Kentucky after a nationwide manhunt. Joe Bartels has the story from Hobbs. Serafio Martinez and his family are outraged that his son's suspected killer, Philip Ed Harrison, is out of jail. Well, I, don't, I don't like it, man, you know, because first of all, you know, I, I think he's a flight risk because, you know, I think that's why he left town. The judge lowered Harrison's bond from 70000 to $40,000. He was able to post it. Police say Harrison murdered 31-year-old Orlando Martinez in September of 2009 at this Hobbs tattoo shop. Harrison moved shortly after the murder to Kentucky and started up another tattoo shop. They were looking for him. They couldn't find him. So they took all this time looking for him and finally uh, America's Most Wanted started putting him on TV. In June, Harrison was captured in Kentucky, then brought back to New Mexico. The DA's office says it agreed to let a magistrate court judge reduce the bond because Harrison waived his preliminary hearing and he's been cooperating. Reporting in Hobbs, Joe Bartels, KOB Eyewitness News 4. Harrison faces up to 20 years in prison if convicted.